Here is today's construction picture. As to what's going on, Kip Smith wrote this excellent description yesterday. Kip says, I spoke with the engineer supervising the work on Falcon Way this morning. There is a T in the water line at that location. The long arms go down Falcon in both directions. The short arm goes to an air relief valve down the hill a ways. It is a white PVC thing. Currently, the three arms have no valves to shut off the water flow. The work today will A. Shut off the water main for a while, B. Cut out a T section of pipe, and then C. Insert a new T with three valves. This will facilitate things when they have to shut down the water for the dig planned for later. That dig will be on the line that runs under the schoolyard, close to the B level entrance below. Timber Ridge's Grand Terrace. Stay well, Kip. The picture on the left shows one of their excavators losing a track. The picture on the right is a neat picture taken by Patty Moulton from down below near State Route 900. The picture on the left shows the completed work on the water line on Falcon Way in the lower right corner. The picture on the right shows the work continuing on the south end, laying water pipe. Two pictures today, both involve trenches and water pipe, one on the south corner, the other on the east side above and parallel to Talus Way. The major activity is with the new water pipe that runs parallel to Talus Drive. In particular, at the time the shot was taken, they were getting ready to install a valve. There is a small new deer excavator involved in this job. The holding pond in the southeast corner is now about half mud and half water. Today has been more of spreading the dirt taken from one of the berms towards the pond. It looks like another dump truck now too has been added and an excavator, a cat, has been removed. The pond is empty but muddy. The scrub trees by the pond are all but gone. The picture on the right shows more construction around the pond taken in the middle of the afternoon.